social distancing and you know some people are wearing a mask which you know i'm hearing mixed reviews some people say that the mask really doesn't do all that much um, in fact the virus is small enough it can actually get through the spaces in the mask which is why the masks that actually have a respirator on them are more of the uh, type that's going to help you be more successful but you know when we look at the relationship between ourselves and our immunity um, you know, I was thinking about it for myself and I was thinking, I feel about, you know, 80 or 90% that most of what I need to pay attention to is on the inside of me. You know, 10%, yes, wash your hands, social distancing, I get all that stuff. But what are you doing on the inside of your body? Because really, ultimately, at the end of the day, if you get exposed to something, whether you react to it or not, is really a function of whether your body is susceptible, whether it's, it's, it's weakened in some way. So, you know, you're finding that people who have, um, or have autoimmunity, that they have some sort of weakness, weakness in their immune system, weakness in the function of their body, are going to become more susceptible to getting the COVID-19. So where are you on a scale of 100%? So I feel like I'm kind of like 80, 20, 90, 10, meaning 80% inside, 20% outside, 90% here, 10% outside. You know, you may be 50, 50 and saying, okay, well, 50%, I feel like, you know, I'm a little bit more susceptible. Maybe, maybe your immune system isn't as strong as it could be. Um, so we're staying open here at Innovation Health. Um, we're actually considered essential services here in Charlotte. And so we, we want to provide chiropractic care and other services for people to make sure that they're helping to boost their immune system. Because it's not just enough to just sit by. People that are sitting inside and they're just sheltering at home and they're not really doing things to help to boost their immune system, you're missing a huge piece of what it takes to actually keep your immune system stronger and healthier and more vibrant so that not only can you get past the COVID-19, but you can help to be resistant to all sorts of different illnesses. Um, you know, the, with the use of antibiotics and other things that are, they're causing the viral, um, the, the, the bacterial and the viral loads to become stronger over time. They've been talking about superbugs for the longest time. And so I think we're at a point in our, in our existence here as humans on the planet that we have to be aware that these buggers are getting stronger. And because they're getting stronger, we have to be more proactive. We have to take charge of our body. And the way that we do that is we focus on the inside. So when we look at those percentages, how much of it is you, how much of it is outside here? So if we can't really control as much on the outside, but we can control what we do on the inside. So looking at your sleep and your food and your stress level and your mindset and the things that are gonna help you to stay stronger inside. And so that's really, again, I'm going to keep beating this, this horse because that is the key. And, you know, for myself, you know, I, you know, again, I'm not a good example here because I've been actually working on my immune system now for the last 33 years I've been working on that. I had a horrible immune system growing up. And so I really have worked on making my body stronger over time. And you can do that, too. You can do that too, but it takes time and it takes energy and it takes focus and it takes a decision that you decide that you want to make your body stronger. And as you allow your body to become exposed, maybe not COVID-19, maybe that's not a good place to start, but if you allow your body to be exposed, it's not a bad thing to get a cold. It's not a bad thing to get the flu even. It's not a bad thing to have a fever. It's not a bad thing. Germs are not your enemy. They're actually part of the solution. It's the way that your body builds immunity. And so in order for your body to be exposed to something and build stronger and get stronger over time, you have to allow your body to react. It's when you suppress it and you take things and you feel uncomfortable so you don't want to um, you don't want to feel uncomfortable. You don't want to feel bad. You know, there's a difference between something be feeling bad and being bad for you. So I don't, I don't know how to say this any differently, but your body is super smart. It's super smart, knows what it's doing. 
It's going to talk to you. It's going to tell you when you have something going on that is, it, it, it's reacting to something that it hasn't identified before. So if your body has seen something before, it goes, oh, I've seen that already. But if it hasn't seen it before, sometimes it'll cause a reaction. And that reaction is your immune system at work. And so if the inside of your body is working well, it's going to do better during those times when you are exposed, whether you're being exposed, whether there's allergens and pollen in the air, whether there's other pathogens in the air, whether it's flu season or whatever it is, haven't ever gotten a flu shot. And I'm not telling you you should get it or not get it. I'm telling you that that does not help you get stronger on the inside. So I want you to think about that. Where are you in that scale there? The inside and the outside. The inside and the outside. And what's going on in the inside is not as much as you need to do as what's going on in the outside. So take, listen to this message. I hope you hear what I'm saying. If you have any questions, leave some comments below, but you can do this. You can do this. You have to start with your mindset. You have to start with your activities. You got to start with the things that you have some control and some choice over so that you can actually make your immune system stronger and you can live a better life. We're going to get all get past this together. Stay strong. I believe in you.